thanks for staying with us. He's an MC, actor, international stand-up comedian, virus skit maker, and the prophet all rolled into one, one of Nigeria's oh top online sensations. He found fame on the Instagram posting videos of, his, of him preaching the gospel in comical ways. Uh, and welcome with us, Mr. Oluwa Toyin, by a group popularly known as Wuli Arole in the building. Woo, woo, woo. Good to have you on the show. Congratulations on your baby and yes, your marriage. Yes. We'll come to just about two later, but first, you must, must enter this conversation. Yes, I must. So we <laughs> talked about men. Today we're discussing men. Okay. And there was a man that started the conversation. All right. He was saying that he used to see inmates and was wondering what they were doing in prison. Mm. So they were in prison because they wanted to uglify their wife. So mm. out of jealousy and insecurity, mm. where the wife is so beautiful, you don't want another man to come and catch her, you know, pour acid. acid on her, you pour hot water on her, or she's flying so high, she's building shops, she's doing stuff, and she's earning more money, mm. and you pull her down, say, ah, you can't go past this level. Mm. You know, and we're discussing, what is that thing that causes insecurity in men? Mm. And we know some men, they don't start out going to that extent, actually. Mm. It starts out being healthy, healthy yeah. jealousy. You know, I don't mm. want you going out, don't wear these shoes out. You know, it makes you, this dress is too short. But gradually, then progresses to the point where it seems very obsessive. Mm -hmm. So as a man, could you help us understand what could make a man jealous mm. or insecure for his so, own? Uh, for me, uh, because I have a bit of background in psychology. Okay. So mm. I'm going to come awesome. from two. Yeah, but that was my first degree in OAU. Uh, before this, oh, <laughs> shouting. So, yeah. from, from <laughs> <laughs> so I've, and I've had this, disc I love that we're having discussion. I've had this same discussion with a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And I said, human beings generally is from two parts, nature and nurture. Mm -hmm. So you're not, the nature is, as you're coming, nurture is your environment. Mm -hmm. Now, we cannot exclude the environment from any human being. Agreed. None. Mm -hmm. None. Okay. Now, if, so, if you, if you and they taught us something in school. If you bring up a child here and another child here, a child in a place of love and affection, mm. a child in a place of hate and disrespect, let them grow. One will be loving naturally, one will be naturally disrespectful. Yeah. Mm. Truth. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Now, so for some of this jealous stuff and all of that, see, a lot of people have actually taught a lot from the environment mm. that they thought they are right. They have bad mind shift. Mm. Example of those mind shift is for you to think that the only subject that is honorable is a man. It's, that one, it's wrong. It's, that's not, it's wrong. Mm. Mm. Or for you to think that your only way of domineering a place is by coarseness. Mm. It is not right, mm. either at work or in marriage. Mm. Can I clap for you? Thank you. <laughs> so, so, so back to this. See, this thing is even beyond marriage. It happens among friends. Yes. Mm. And you begin to see that people are insecure by the kind of jokes they throw. Hmm. Oh, tell, hmm. tell them. I'm tell telling them. you, you know, just like I, I, I was having a discussion with somebody and I say, okay, let, let's say, look at the way you are, like, ah, uh, mama, you look very fine, Miss Mariah, I love what mm -hmm. you're wearing and all of that. I'm healthy. Another yeah. person will look at you. I'm like, mm. you, know, you, know, you, the big you, you get what I'm saying? Yeah, so, I so just, there is this. Joking. So now, mm -hmm. now, that's now entering into marriage. Some people have grown to see maybe their parents. And they think that is a normal structure. Mm. How their father treated their moms. Mm. You know, mm. thinking that, you know, they need to exert a lot of force. Mm. That a woman can just be confined to the subject of a kitchen and just raising children. That was what they saw. Hey. And you know, understand? So they never saw where a woman can be so global, mm. have influence, mm. and do a lot of stuff. Mm. Mm. Preach it. Hey. Preach it. <laughs> So if Prophet that kind of woman is not trying to say, I'm beyond the four walls of a, or the, no, the place of a kitchen. Yeah. I'm you can't I, yes, you can't. So that man starts feeling that his ego is bruised. Mm. Mm. That you cannot be sharing equality with me. Mm. And well, sorry, I'm, I'm faith-based and I'm going to come from faith angle. And Bible says that the highest in the kingdom should be the servant. Mm. That's it. Mm. The highest, the peak, a lead. So Jesus Christ was a servant leadership yeah, person. Yeah, yeah. If, leader. Yes, that's it. And when, when I... Thank God I'm married. I'm from my own little experience at home. I told my wife from start, I said, see, we are married to both of us express our dreams. Mm -hmm. I failed as an husband. If in five years of marriage, all they see is just about really, and there's nothing about your subject. Mm -hmm. about, she's a nurse. Let me tell you this. She's a nurse. And at times she said that, ah, my babe, this story. I say, this thing you are doing, keep going at it. You've, you have, she has a master's. I say, you are not going to end that master's. Mm -hmm. You are going to do your PhD. Hey, no, I'm okay. Oh! <laughs> And she would tell me, if you are not just going to be an actor. You are going to produce your own movie. Mm. You are going to do your own stand-up comedy. Mm, so it. it makes it, that's it. That's it. That's it. Healthy 
So we keep it. She encourages me. I encourage her. Now about the second woman group. I met a top CEO, female, at the CEO event, and she was talking. And then she mentioned that her marriage is where it is. Her career is growing in her marriage because her mother-in-law was a chief magistrate. Mm. Mm. Which start that will you come and bring inside that house? Thank and you. you. Come Thank and you, ma. Sit down Thank somewhere. you. How important mm. is that vision for a young girl looking to marry now? Ah, let me just go and marry somebody. Do you just those external factors? Are they the family important to consider? See, let me tell you this. Uh, one of our, my very like a father figure to me, mm. and I love him so much, made this statement. And any young people I try to see, I tell them, please, I beg. Some of my friends, they know me. I, I tweet this thing. There are some category of people that, uh, uh, permit me to say, I, I beg you. It is not safe. I love to use that word, mm. to get married to them. Mm. Mm. Look at the word. It is not safe. Give us my my father-in-law is Dr. Dikyo Luka, a modern of American community, Geo. And he has some very deep messages on relationship. See, anybody that he himself has not discovered himself mm. is very, it's not safe, ma. It's not safe. I agree with no, you. No, wow. ma, I'm telling you. Aware. I'm telling you. Now, wow. Because of how I, you know, I'm, I'm also a bit tilted to, to religion, and I see people bring cases to me, prophet, all of that. You see, you don't want to hear people's cases in marriage. Mm -hmm. You will advise your younger sister, your brother. Mm. You see, anybody that feels threatened, Mm. By their every really little level of success, mm. it's not safe. Mm. Even no. to keep as a friend. No, no, no. Mm. No, 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 no. 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 Mm. Pretty, see, I don't care if he's a worker in the church. Mm. I don't care if he's, a, he's an imam. Mm. I don't care your religion. If this person is not healthy enough to see that life is about collectivity and collaboration. Mm. Uh, Forget it. Mm, uh, hey, there's a man. Well, oh, um, okay. Let me let BC come in there. Ah, this thing you mentioned now. You Ma. know, these days, yes, sir. people's eyes are beginning to open yes. because of globalization. Yes. Things are happening very fast. But in our time, hmm. some of us married before knowing who we were. Thank you. So if you have a young girl now who is uh, 20, 21, 22, 24, and hasn't even okay. discovered herself, are you saying they shouldn't marry her? So this is my point, ma. See, that married thing is <laughs> <She's> deep. <laughs> Mommy, <laughs> it's long. Mm. Okay. Lifetime. Um, you get what I'm saying? Okay. Oh, oh, or gone. Mm. See, and they say that there's a Yoruba adage, permit me to say, they say, en en enter by with my mm. You understand? My mom used to give a very powerful proverb, very deep. He said that a young boy was looking at his mother, and he said, Mommy, why is your eyes inside? Mm. Ah! The mama yeah, said, Hold on. <laughs> Time we <with> take. <laughs> <laughs> he said, What the other have seen that has see. made the eyes go inside? inside. Uh -uh. Mm. A young boy, if he climbs on top of a tree, cannot see it. Mm. That's your turn. Again, because this. Marriage is you and this person. Okay. Again, so, wait so, how your do time. you. I, so, wait I your time. Let me ask my question. How do you now uh, sift people who. Because you know, I'm asking this question. Yes, please ask. Some me. people find themselves later in life. Of course. Some have clarity early, early on. Early, yes. So, are you now dis, you know, putting people on a disadvantage, those who haven't found their purpose before getting married? So, this, That's is, what this is it. So, life is a journey. So, okay. we keep finding it. Okay. Yes. It's not total. Okay. Yes. So at the time, okay, it's comedy for me. At the time, okay, it's acting yeah, as joy. Yeah, at the time, this. Yeah. But this is my own. Even if it's a glimpse of your life, I feel it is very wise that you catch it. Okay. Yeah. Because okay. this is it. This have is why it's risky. Yes, ma'am. Have a dream. Have a vision. Yeah. Okay. You, you, it's not, you might not catch it in totality. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, it will fold. There's that, a man that said that if you, if, uh, if you find your woman, or you cheap, as it was easy, it was easy to get her. Mm. You know, the reason why you're insecure with her is because you don't want another man to catch her the way you easily caught her. Mm. Is that a justifiable reason for you to be insecure? Uh, so, for me, I feel there's no reason for being insecure. Mm. For me, personally. Mm. You know, this life of a teen is perceptions. There's no final theory or law for anything. Now, the way people run their homes are different. Mm -hmm. That's why marriage counseling is good and all of that. Mm. But in as much as we are doing all of this, there's dynamics to life. Mm. Some people met their wife, you know, casual and all of that. Mm. 20, 30 years and they're fine. Good. Some, it didn't happen that way. Mm -hmm. Madam, either you find your wife sheep or not sheep. Let me say, 
a person that will be insecure by the special grace of God oh, will be insecure. However, he finds you. Like that, mind correct. Yeah, if you like, find inside plane. <laughs> if you like, don't you, you don't yeah. say yeah. it. It's about you. Yes, yeah. the, the, that's why I say the person. Mm. You know, everything I've been addressing is not even about the marriage structure. You see, mm. that person. Mm. You know, that's something you also said. You talked about nature and nurture. Yes. Yes. So is this, uh, I think, it was Mocha that she said something one time that struck me. She said when she was growing up, her mom taught her about love, Thank you. but she never taught her about hate. Hmm. So she grew up just being Loved. loving and showing love, and then she found herself in the uh, uh, midst of people who also showed her hate, Jeez. and she could not address it. Hmm. Now, we have conversations where people are saying, you know, before, when you want to get married, they'll ask you the, somebody's background, and we thought that's not the right hmm. way to go. Hmm. Are we saying now that when our parents or our agent um, parents used to say, what is this person's background? Is it about nature, or is it about... I'm trying to find out if they are financially, in, you know. See, my that question, see, let me tell you something, and I've said it. An elderly person, hmm. someone that is older than you. You see, that's why this new age get a generation, they will miss out on a lot of things. Hmm. God help them. Hmm. I'm telling you, ma, that that's why check it out. Short span soft. Hmm. Short span success. Hmm. Okay, let me give an example. If Auntie has already come, she's more experienced than me in marriage. This one, two, three, three things were things I noticed. Add this. That's an advice woman. Yeah. Inside yeah. me. Because experience. a mission I want to learn. Experience. And this thing doesn't cut. And I see a lot of young people that are very proud. Mm. I say, oh, she told yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. You get so your mother is telling you, you that. Hey, that's. You get. Yeah. That person used to do yeah, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> and this thing doesn't, it's not religious based. Intellectual stuff is not religiously based. Mm. Mm. Willie, I want you Logic. to talk to Willie, I want you to talk to men. There are men watching you this morning. And they feel quite insecure, not because they don't want their wives to fly, mm. you know. They and they and they cannot replace their backgrounds. They've yeah. had their backgrounds. Of, Unfortunately, of I mean, I'm a, I'm a grown man, yeah. and my background is my background. Yeah. However, I I am a man. I'm just so I'm so scared yeah, I know. that this is my wife, right. yes. who is doing so, so well, will okay. leave me. Will not just leave me, but will find will be, will be disrespectful to me eventually because she's doing part. so well. Yeah, I know that. Part. I feel that. She would that respect right. that I that yes. I uh, that I yeah, desire I know, I know man, that, that is my love language. Yes, yes. I will not have it to diminish it because yes. she's talking to MDs. Yes. She's talking to she's trying flying to Taiwan for for a meeting for mm -hmm. heaven's sakes. Mm -hmm. And I'm here in Ogudu waiting for her to come back. Trying to cross the bridge. Trying to cross the bridge. <laughs> How do I <coughs> handle it well, as a man? Mm. Very true. I love that question. Because that's why that insecurity thing is very broad. So and success has different things from you. If you are not careful, it can sweep you away. Yes. That's why you see a successful man or a woman, if you are not careful, you can be successful outside and the home is wrecked. Yes. yes. On both sides. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. Now, that is one of the essence of doing this show. Yes. Anybody watching. Because life is about learning, unlearning, and relearning. Yes. Yeah, true. There were things you thought were right. Sir, it is not right. Okay. That's fact. Yes. You know it. Okay. You're, because at the end of the day, if your wife goes out, your wife is your pride. Hmm. Let, me, let, let me keep you this. This something happened. This is very funny. So... I posted some, you see people's mindset too. This one is very funny, man. I posted something on Instagram. And I was, you know, eulogizing my wife. I post her once in a while, maybe once in three or four months. And I use the word, my crown. Watch, oh, see mindset, my crown. Somebody now commented. I know. She be your husband. Thank you. Watch, man, watch. <laughs> Somebody now commented that, no, I don't really know, no. 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 Prophet, no, no, she or she. Mm -hmm. she shot. Yeah. Coffee, coffee. Listen, you know I said, how can the wife be the crown? Mm. Normally, it's they smart. will say that yes, or call me mm. a deori. That's and I ref mean. Yes, don't worry. Mm. Can I refer the guy back to scripture? Mm. Is there in Proverbs? Preach it. That says the wife is the crown of the man. Yes! And I yeah. And I, I explain. It. If you are a king, the wife is the crown that beautifies your kingdom. Mm. Why didn't you get pregnant mm. and go to that nine, year, nine months mm. in pain? Back to me. I think we need to keep giving women the roses they deserve. Hey, we'll take it. I know some men, I know I've got the program. Some men will come after me that we'll take it. But it's the Let truth. Let them bring it on. Bring, bring it's the roses. truth. Yeah. It's I've the truth. That's it. It's Please. the truth. Which school did you go that you learned this, that the other is not learned? No, I think it's the school of life. <laughs> and God, that you know, God is the giver. Well, we sit down. See, there's we no need a, you know, churches used to do I'm sorry, uh, Nima. Churches used to do it. They'll have men's fellowship. Mm -hmm. And I'm curious to know what it is that they are being taught. Because we have, as you said about religion, it's not about your religion. Because we find this insecurity. Whatever religion people practice. So how does a young man, very young man like you, 
understand insight and wisdom that many people in their 40s fifties and fifties don't have. I think it's God. That's just God's own. It's self-reflection. Mm. See, we are who we are, like Morel said, yes. from our various backgrounds. Yes. yes. What what kind of life do you desire Thank in you, the future? Thank you, Yeah. So all of us. Okay, let me talk for myself. Where I did start here. Mm -hmm. I have Coming grown on yeah, my own terms. I am constantly reflecting yeah. on the mm. life that I want mm. and how to get there. And you cannot go there. You can't be in a marriage and only you want to go. Mm. Bad, it's two people. Now. So how do you go and the other person too can go? Because mm. two of you have to be happy mm. for a happy marriage to mm. exist. You are constantly reflecting on what you're doing, mm. how it's affecting the other party, mm. and how you must bring that party. That self-reassurance you're talking about, how you must bring that other party to own it mm. and believe that that thing is not destructive to them. Mm. Simple, constantly okay. building yourself like this because you're looking at yourself yes. and constantly wanting Let to Let me take this call from Mama. Like Mama, are you there from Abuja? Yes, good morning, Good morning, you're live. Go ahead, please. I'm a first-time caller. Welcome to the show. And I'm starstruck. Mm -hmm. yes. Mama, where are you? I want to contribute on this topic you are talking about. Yes, please. Go ahead. I have a friend. I have a friend. She's exactly in this situation. Mm. Your husband is so insecure about her. They work virtually in the same environment. So he knows her income, what she's to earn at the end of the year. So there was a time she was supposed to... Um, they were supposed to pay her one allowance. So he sneaked behind her, went to the office to ask how much uh, they are going to pay her and when it's going to come in. So eventually when the money came in, she didn't tell him that she had received the money and she spent it. His, his expectation was for her to give him the money to put into a project they are doing and she didn't. She spent the money without telling him. Hmm. At the end of the day, he went back to his relatives, told them so many bad Lines. things about her. Her always raising shoulders for him because she thinks she earns more than him. Um, so many, so many bad things. She came here crying that this is what happened. I hmm. said, okay, this is what you do. Maybe next time, since you know that he sneaks behind you to ask. Um, the stuff you are going to earn from your work, maybe you let him know, give him part of it. She said, no, she has been doing that. Virtually everything in that house. Right. So. Okay. Thank you very much, Mama. Let me go on a quick break. When we come back, we'll just wrap up and then go into Eliza interview. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Thanks for staying with us. Let's take a few messages. We have to wrap up very soon on this. Um, Maryam, take okay, a few. Uh, Itunu says, God give me understanding that I may not go astray. Some people mm. find understanding early, some middle, and some at the end of their life. Mm. And finally, some will never find it. Mm. I pray to find it early. Amen. Mm. Someone is saying on Twitter, mm. Woli really has failed to expand on the issue of women changing and becoming rude yes. when success comes. If women can be told not to allow success get in their heads, mm. there will be no major issues. It's my kid that is talking to Let me you. just add this one to okay. it so you can do it together. This one says, I currently have a girlfriend who is disrespectful to me because I am not rich, but don't mind showing me off. What should I do? I like her and I fancy her. So the, I know they're going to come from this angle. And this is not just about women to Michael. This is the truth. Success is individualistic. Yeah. If a man, the object of a man is successful, if you don't control it, you'll be disrespectful. If a woman is successful, if you don't control it, you'll be disrespectful. Anybody. So don't make success, don't make it yeah, gender-based. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah. So because we're going to start mixing this up. Hey. That it's because my wife is rich. Hey. So let us address disrespectful as a subject matter. Hey. And don't let us put gender into it. Yeah. 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 To add to that, people hmm. say you know a man's true character when he has money. Of course now. So most times we start out poor and we are growing. Mm -hmm. we the, woman's, really... the woman's true character to comes out when she has money. That's what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. So we, we have not truly expressed our true character. Yes. Now when you now get the money that you cannot hide your face from anybody, you now express yes, so. and it's seen as disrespectful. You have always been okay. disrespectful. Yes. You just have an opportunity. So no, because that's, but that's where just that is where most men will now come. Harone, but this is not talking. My wife, she has a kidney character. When she has money, she now before she has money, that thing has been there. 
Mm. So it's so disrespect is not gender based. Yeah. Success okay. is not gender based. We have to wrap this up. So let me say that we can tie this we, we up wish together. We just take this I really, please. <laughs> For those I people enjoy it. already in this sort of marriage, I will record it and give plenty of my down friends. Down now. Now. Let's Let's give question. solution to our viewers. Those people who are already in this sort of marriage, okay. where the man is either insecure and okay. planning to uglify them, what ah. can they do? What can the men also do to change? So talk to the women and talk to the men. Talk to the men. So for the men, please, if you're a man and you're watching this program. This program is particularly, let me do as if I'm a president addressing please, fellow please. men. Yes. Please go ahead. I beg mm -hmm. in the name of God, your wife is God's treasure to you. Mm -hmm. Please, love and cherish her. Mm -hmm. Please. It's because of it that God is lifting her up now. Mm -hmm. yes. Oh, yes. yes. And madam, if money comes, you two you are gonna talk here. Yeah, yeah, something yeah, pick yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Can you, you understand? Please. Mm -hmm. It makes the world beautiful. Yeah. When, you know, one succeeds, the other succeeds. And there is time for life. The time that the old man will be rich might not be the time the wife will be rich. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Take the process, it tell you, you know, me. Let everything be soft. Long oh, nice. So let's talk about what you're working on because we know yeah. you have a major event coming up. Tell us about it. So it's my stand-up comedy show. After, yeah, yes, I haven't done it. I've, I think I've not done it since I left uni, uni yeah. over 10 years. So I'll be doing a proper stand-up stand comedy show yeah. with a lot of my friends, mm. musicians, mm. At a hotel. Uh, and a Zuna. hotel, huh? Yeah. Wow, how I bet that's funny. How much is it? How much is it? No, no, you people, I have a special invite for. The ladies and gentlemen. We are six. 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 No, 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 no. Uh, you, once, uh, yes, once you get there, they'll put you. No, you guys are special. You don't drive. Uh, no, 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 Yes. 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 All right, so Thank tell you. us the day, the time, the venue, room. and everything. So it's on the 27th. Okay. That's next week, Sunday. Sunday, okay. Yeah, and it's at a hotel, 6 p.m. Where do we get tickets we from? Where do we want? Or area ticket. You area can, ticket. Yeah, an area oh, ticket is there. Nice. Then people can reach me on IG, Instagram. I, I answer people myself. Oh, nice. So apart from you, who else are we going to see? So Alibaba is there, AY. Oh. Ah. Ah. Timmy Dapolo. Ah. It, it's going to, I just want, and another reason I'm doing this again. Is, is beyond show for me. Mm. Okay. I want family to come together. Mm. Well yeah. done, well done. Yeah. You no, know, let's laugh together. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna yeah. be mad though. Yeah. Hey. So maybe that's where this idea is <laughs> coming from. <laughs> My parents are gonna be there as well. Oh, They've yeah. been married for over 45 years. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Stand up. Yeah. yeah I, yes. They, they, they be, and I've learned a lot from them. And I'm gonna be doing jokes around. You know how they live, the love they have. You know, I said, Talk about Alabiz is coming. Yes, Talk about Alabiz is coming. Uh, Choma Jesus is coming. A lot of my. Will we meet your wife there? Yes, she's coming. I'm my son. Oh, I'm not really, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so, fantastic. So, so that's, so how, is, how is marriage? Tell us. Mm. What, what are those things your wife does? Ah, <laughs> let me tell you something. Marriage. So cute. <laughs> for me, marriage is, is sweet for me, and I'm very happy that marriage is also sweet for her. Mm. I'm sure this is how. You know, this insecurity thing wanted to affect me. That's why I'm she's very, very, you know, grounded. Mm. Now, my wife is Irish. I'm Nigerian. But she's, she's a Yoruba girl, but she, you know, she went oh, to yes. the Highlands. Now, Insecurity of family started affecting me of background of Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Agidi <laughs> Now, no, it's, no, that's Sorry. why, no, I sincerely, no, you know, know, before I used to say, I'm the man of the south. Can't take it. I can't, even when we're dating, <laughs> one day I now started with myself. Small thing my wife would say. Now, this is not the funniest part. So, at the time when I go to meet my wife in the UK, she's this person that is quite quiet, and I'm loud. So, my wife say, babe, you shouting. <laughs> shouting. Sonic pay. Wait, oh, Koto Sonic pay. Nigerian. Your voice is Ulesha loud. Law. Look at what my Nigerian mind is saying. Hey. <laughs> so I have last speaker in my tongue. And I say, so I'm shouting now. <laughs> oh, that, that day has scattered. <laughs> that day has scattered. No, I'm not kidding. So I started coming back to myself that issues we're having, even when we're dating, mm. and what? This thing is not a big issue. Mm. You understand? Mm. So that feeling that, so there are times that it's my wife that will be at home. You know, I would do some stuff in the house. She will go out, she comes back, and I realize that I've washed plates in the house. Mm. I still wash plates. Mm. I it's am a comfortable there. plate washer. Yeah. <laughs> I am excited to wash plates. Hey. I change pampas. I'm excited to, to change pampas. <laughs> that's the fact. Because there's beauty when we even raise it's the child together. together. Yeah, it's sweet. At times, there's some gist that is in the kitchen. If, if my wife is cooking, Hi. I follow her to the kitchen. Yes. Yes. So, yes. so, hey. so it's like friends. Oh, oh, yeah. so, yeah. so, yeah. The fact that we are fighting in Palo, by the time we enter the kitchen, you know that that so, fight so, will go down. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm not saying, some things can happen in the kitchen. It's even more with the kitchen. Yellow red cloth.
was on the train from Ibadan once, and my husband was asking, what do I bring her? What do I make for the family? Mm -hmm. And I was describing what I had in the freezer, and I looked around me. Oh. It was me, I said, ah. I'm sending my husband cook food. Cook food. I have to slow my voice. I think we should normalize this thing. See, I'm on the train. Let me tell you I'm, food. I, I, ma, I've cracked a joke. I said, as I am now, I used to crack that. I say, it's, all this, you are the head of the house. It's pure scam. It's scam. You are, the moment you're a husband to a servant, <laughs> you will serve your wife. Mm -hmm. You will serve your son. Mm -hmm. You will serve you your serve daughter. Yeah. And respect will come for you naturally. Hey. Hey. You my wife said me, close. babe, when you're coming, Blanche Stratford. I'm from say yes, I will say yes, ma. <laughs> me too, when she's going out, you two buy something. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Fantastic. So Thank you. We need to bring you back. Think of having a men's conference. Mm. Yeah. People will come. Where you can give some of these nuggets. Yeah. I know you're young and married. You could also collaborate with people who have yeah. even young people that need it. Yeah. The ones that are just the ideal You can mix the experiences so that you share someone 10 years, 20. We can work together. No, I would. I would. In fact, I have, I have friends fellowship, a fellowship that I have with some of my friends. Mm. We just gather. And this stuff, you know, mm. let me just tip this in before, before, you know, this thing happened. It's a friends fellowship. We just pray and we encourage ourselves. Our daughter there. A particular family reached out to me. This thing is very funny. Watch. Madam, I reached out to me. I really, ah, I'm going to leave my wife. I see if I'm the one that married the wife for you. <laughs> I know. Because she used to do prayer. I will leave her. I said, calm down. So me and my friend, when I went to the man's. Ma, the issue, I will not call the wife. The man, he said, my wife is disrespectful. My wife does, does this insecurity. I say, oh, God, calm down. If somebody is disrespectful, if you throw love to her, mm. what is the language she will return? Now, so after, and I went to the house, I met the woman. That day we felt stupid. It was me and Dakwawe. And I asked her, please, that woman that is disrespectful. <laughs> As you got the woman, I said, ah, eka bepele, the wife yeah. is calling yeah. like this. Ah, I look at her, I said, so you stress me to come to your family. You have already sorted this thing with love already. <laughs> There's nothing left to give. <laughs> so at <laughs> times, the, you know, the what we think, the issues are not really You make issues. mountains out of nothing. Yeah. Mm. Oh, we have no, to run. Yeah, Thank awesome. you very much. I enjoyed myself. We got to bring you back. <laughs> I think we need, when we need male perspective, we bring when we need male perspective, we'll bring you on. We'll bring you on. So don't forget, the event is also coming up next week. Sunday, please buy your tickets. Yeah. We'll all meet you there. We are coming in with invites. In. I can't wait. The ladies of your view are coming with invites. We'll see you there. So all right, then have a fabulous weekend. We'll see you Monday. Very lovely way to bye for now. End the show. Very Thank nice. you. Thank you.